Yeah, we She left. He left. Uh, hit pause. <laughs> Why'd he leave? Hey! Come on, dude, we got a lot of work to do today. Come on, a lot of shit. Come on. <laughs> A lot, of, a lot of questions, a lot we need to answer. There's a lot of work to do today, too, like real, like actual work. <laughs> hey, hey, when he gets to the podium, when he says stop, go on the crossroads. things up right now this isn't gonna be run by the peanut gallery all right you guys try to do weird music and weird shit and I walk the fuck out and I'll do it again if this gets out of control this is my press conference I'm gonna run it how I want to run it so if you guys have questions maybe we'll get to them and if the question is inappropriate or wrong I'm leaving so think about that when you're asking your questions the Christy Teigen thing last night which people are all freaking out about I want to say a couple things on this. First of all, and again, everyone saw my Lester apology. I'm a man. When I'm wrong, I walk up to the mic, I say it was wrong. I make a man apology. Last night's Tegan thing may be the most overblown event in the history of the internet. The history of the internet. Now, let's clear a couple things up. I just randomly threw that tweet out. Uh, what did I say? that she's mad she can't play super hot girl which isn't even that bad of a thing to say um and then candace came on the screen and i start i if, if people longtime stoolies will remember i once made a hell's bells video of candace swain pole walking it was awesome i actually tweeted back and forth with candace at the time and she loved every second of it so I said, you know what? I'm going to make this video again because the account is pulled down. I don't have it. I spent half an hour trying to make this video. I couldn't get the sound right. I was trying to make it a vine. It was a debacle. Anybody who's interneted in their life knows when you're making one of those things with Movie Maker, you don't see anything else. I didn't see any of these tweets coming back and forth that Tegan, first of all, I don't even know how Christy Tegan found this tweet. I don't not tweet at you because I'm afraid of you. It's just... I figure she's got a lot of followers. She doesn't. I'm not trying to concern her with it. I'm just making funny things. I'm entertaining people. That's my that's my job. It has nothing to do with being afraid. I don't even know if I had enough Twitter character to tweet at her. Whatever. That's not the point. Somehow she found it. I have no idea how she found it, but she did, and she tweeted at me, and people went bananas. Now, by the time I found out this happened, it was too late. It was half an hour, and it looked like I went silent when, in fact, I was working for people. I was trying to make this Kansas video so people would have something to laugh at, enjoy, and get through your miserable lives. And this is the thanks I get that everyone's piling on and going crazy. Again, by the time I saw that tweet, it was like one of those fights in the crowd where you're standing the row behind, underneath. You don't have the higher ground anymore. That's pretty much the situation I was in. It was There was nothing I could have said at that point to reverse the tide of me being silent for half an hour. Maybe I could have thrown out the jerk store line. Maybe my shoulder hurt or neck. But it was too late. I lost the higher ground. And again, even what she said... I don't understand what people are freaking out about, being like, dead this. She's like, what, are you afraid to tweet at me? And then some line, which, again, I didn't even see in real time because it's getting so many comments, like, what, do you jizz on your keyboard? I mean, come on, that that's second-grade stuff. It's not that funny. So I played along, ha-ha, Prez is dead. Prez is not dead. He's very much alive. And he's standing right here, looking right at that camera. So, yeah, I guess it's funny, but I... I I mean, it's funny it got to this point that Boston Magazine is writing articles about how I'm dead. I'm, again, 
I am not dead. I was never dead. I, I laughed it off. Ha, ha, ha. Put some t-shirts on sale and went to bed. But this evisceration, this is one of the most overblown stories in the history of the internet. I guess if you guys have questions, Vidalberg? So the Candace video is just gone? No, if you want to go look, do you want to come, do you want to take the camera and look at all the video? Do they timestamp that shit? Timestamp what? Like when I'm actually making the videos. I have like 30 videos on my iPhone of Candace doing her little so, twirl. But now when I'm making a video on my iPhone, and I'm, if I have a lot of Twitter action, it'll pop up. I'll have a little drop down. If I have, especially people like Chrissy Teigen. On, video, when you're using your camera? Oh, yeah. I was just doing the Gronk vines, and it, people kept fading. You're, you're a nobody. I have constant Twitter well, action. Well, she has a significant... Yeah, but you're a nobody. I mean, I have people video. tweeting at me all the time. It was the live show of the thing. I didn't notice it. I don't know if that's how it works when you're in camera mode, but that's what I was doing. And then when I'm in, once I got the videos, I emailed them to myself, which, if you want to go look at my email when I'm emailing myself the videos, and then I'm in Movie Maker. I'm not on my phone, I'm not doing anything. I'm in Movie Maker trying to put together this thing. Uh, you can look when I downloaded Hell's Bells. You can look at all, the proof is there, I have nothing. Who comes up with that lie trying to make Hell's Bells? Anybody else? Yes? Uh, in a sense, would you say the original tweet kind of backfired and uh, created Chrissy being uh, the cool girl for the night? No, it proved my point. That's what she loves doing. She loves being the cool, funny girl. It wasn't that. That's my whole point about Chrissy Teigen. She she tries to be like, who, what, hot girl? I, you said you know how she found that tweet. How did you find it? Someone attached her to it. You mean I, I tweeted and somebody sent it to her? Yeah. I mean, I'm surprised. She she did what she wanted. She proved my point. I'm right. That's a, that's a point in my I home. mean, the... The original tweet from her wasn't wasn't all that bad. I'm not gonna. Wasn't all that I'm good. Not, I'm not gonna give. It no, I mean that's what I mean. I'm not, it wasn't a, a, an evisceration. It, it wasn't a beat. And down. my tweet wasn't the, like that the, violent. The death the death didn't start until your silence. Yeah, because that minute. was I was making a Candace. Well, now this is interesting. Hank, <laughs> Hank, Hank, Hank had so much fun. Hank, Hank was probably an internet. Co Did you send the video, Hank? What video? Did you attach it to Christy T? <laughs> no. Now. It's just, I'm just trying to get in your head here. In the middle of the Victoria's Secret fashion show, which is only an hour long, you decided to take a half hour to make a Candace video? I wanted the Candace video before the show ended. I think she came on around 45. It was it's an hour show, 1045, I believe she came on. It was when she was she led. They did the lights, and then she popped up. And then I believe she came on at the end in black, and I tried to re-add that part to it at the end. But I wanted this, vi I wanted it to be a seven second vine, I couldn't do it. It was nine seconds, I was cutting, I had the music in the background. Again, all the evidence is clearly there for my Candace video. It's, it's just a suspicious amount of phone use to not see anything going on on Twitter. You were tweeting every minute. I mean, you're, you're a shareholder. This is your product. Yeah, and but, you don't how, use it but, for but how, how long had I stopped tweeting before. I don't even really know. I think I had stopped. She I tweeted right back at you within a minute. No, she didn't. That's a lie. You're lying. No, I wouldn't, I wouldn't you have incorrect liar. facts per usual, <laughs> Hank, you fucking liar. Why don't you get your facts straight before you come at me like that? I did two more tweets after the after the Tegan one. I think they're both about Candace murdering people. And then I'm like, I gotta make a video. So, Hank, get your game together. Don't come to a press conference like a half-ass bum and ask bum questions that aren't true. Yes. Would you say all in all yesterday was the worst day of your life? No. <laughs> Listen, I'm about the page views. I don't care. Again, I didn't think I... I wasn't even attacking Christy Teigen that much. The Lester thing hurt, but I didn't get that till the morning. Well, we have... I mean, we had a squirrel... I don't care about the squirrel. The office. We I don't care about the squirrel. The roof cave in. So? No one's dead. We're here. <laughs> we had I Teigen can't do that. That's a landlord problem. That's not a Lester. me problem. Hey, hey, you're, you're, right, you're right. You're oh, right. I'm, say that louder. You're right. Okay. Wrong. Yeah, you were. Who comes to a press conference that you guys have been planning for how long? Like, all morning, he's like, we're doing a press conference. You're one question, you don't even have the facts right. Congrats. What? With every fight, there's a winner and a loser. Do you think you were the winner or the loser? Again, it was a. It, I was never in. By the time I realized I was in a fight, it was too late. 
I so I didn't really throw any punches. I was that guy that's two rows underneath at the stadium. If I throw a punch, I'm gonna roll down the stairs. Now Stoolies had a good laugh at it. Fine, I, you know that's fine by me. But I first of all, my original tweet wasn't even that aggressive. Like, oh, she wants to play hot girl at the Victoria's Secret Fashion Show. That's kind of a blah tweet. And then her thing back to me was kind of a blah thing. Like, who's afraid to at somebody? I I don't, in a weird way in my world, when I don't put at Christy Teigen or at, it's just I'm thinking I'm below them. Like, they don't want to be bothered by me. It's like when people talk about me, don't, don't, don't. Send it to me. I don't give a fuck what you have to say. Talk about me on your own time. That's kind of how I look at that. From now on, I will tweet at Christy Teigen whenever I mention her. That's a promise. Yeah? So Some people are saying this is equating to when the Russian was cut. Do you feel as though you're still at the top of your game or... Of course. If it takes you a half hour to make a video, you can't be at the top of your game. I, the, the video did not come out well. I didn't even use it. It's, that's suspicious, you know. Again, if you want to take the camera off that thing and go look at my phone and go look at my emails and look at my window movie maker, I'm more than happy to do all of that. These are all things that could have been done after. I'm pretty sure the email would be time stamped of when I sent myself the emails from the camera. Again, a lot of... Again, again, a diabolical proof from the press. Look, if, I'm, if I'm looking at my phone nonstop for a half hour... I'm gonna see it, tweets. It, 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 it's, it's I'm a, gonna see it, tweets. It's a brutally disrespectful <clears throat> thing to say to think that I would be seeing constant tweets from like Christy Teigen and not respond. Of course I would respond. I've made a living. I've made a career. You guys have jobs by me responding. I'd respond. I didn't know. Well, that's that's what we thought when the night started, and now it kind of seems but like again, our leader going, is going back to Hank's down. question, which he fucked up miserably. <laughs> How long was the delay? I had already stopped tweeting before she. There's, there's. It. I was going almost nonstop, and then I stopped because I went to make my, my movie. And at some point, her. At some point, she came out of the clouds, and and I was no longer following Twitter. I was no longer tweeting. I was making content. I was doing what I get paid to do. You tweeted at 10:42. She tweeted you at 10:43. Like your most. She tweeted you at 10.43, and your most recent tweet before that was at 10.42. The Candace one? Yes. Let me see. That's a wild coincidence, then. <laughs> oh, I feel like we got a lot of those going on right now. That's 10.42. Yep. Ten forty-three. That's a wild coincidence. <laughs> That's a wild coincidence. So, so we're just going to chalk a lot of this up to coincidence. No, I mean, the timing of everything I say is right. That's all. Again, I can go, I have the proof on my computer. I have, I have, I think I made five different Candace videos of my phone in my pocket. What I'm just saying is I don't think there's been a half hour in four years when I haven't checked Twitter. Straight. When and, I, and I imagine you're the same way. No, when I'm making videos, I stop. Or if I'm writing a blog. Like, if I'm writing a blog that takes a while, I don't check Twitter in the middle of the blog. If this video was so important that took 30 minutes to make outside of an important thing that you usually tweet... Hold on. Instantly. The show was at the 45-minute mark when I started this. It was almost over. So you skipped the grand finale. The grand finale sucks. It's, they just come out and do things. I grabbed that last clip of Candace. It was pretty much over. So it was important enough to do it, but it wasn't important enough to actually show the finished product? I, it didn't come out well. I had all sorts of sound issues. I had like the sound from the TV with the Hell's Bells and, and because it was playing on the back of my computer. I'll show you, the product didn't come out well. As important, I make content. That's what we do here. Was that I didn't think it was overly important. I thought it would be funny. It could be argued that Chrissy really was the content creator last night. That's fine. Um, that's good. Is that a put down to me? Hey, Chrissy Teigen's creating content for us for free. It just that, seems like a cool that, girl that, move. That's a win for me. She was the cool girl. She played the cool girl, which is my whole point of my tweet. And you idiots lapped it up. You just sat there, you know, like dogs drinking warm milk, psyched as can be. I'm happy. This is great. I don't care. It's just crazy. I mean, let's not make it seem like the thing that I don't get is this, this 
murder thing. It wasn't that funny what she said. It wasn't that funny what I said. But when someone doesn't respond for a half hour, death can be the only... It wasn't even... The, the original joke wasn't that she murdered you. The original joke was the president had a heart attack. That's cool. He's, he's yeah. dead. Right. That's. And then it became, okay, wait, never mind, he's back. Right. And then it, she it's killed It's just him. circumstances. I think as we've all talked about and confirmed and agreed to, if I was paying attention to Twitter, I, I certainly would have responded. I've never not responded. And it wasn't like she said something so vicious that I would have been like, oh my God, I can't reply to this. It was a blah comment. That's it. Um, let's just reenact it for one quick second. In real time, if you were to get this tweet, on a scale of 1 to 10, how scared are you to at me, tough guy? What's your response? Go. Zero. <laughs> you would have ignored it? No, I would have said zero. <laughs> that was just for you? Okay. I mean... Do you have any questions, Lewis? <laughs> would would the Dave Portnoy, who stood next to the Boston Globe and was flailing the fucking newspaper at them to get the, to get the Barstool Sports newspaper in front of him, would he have taken 27 minutes to respond? That guy was hungry. That guy was hungry. I, that's, I, what, course, that's what I'm scared of. Of course I was being hungry. Are you guys not listening? I was being hungry by making a video. You think I want to sit on my knees with my fucking camera, like with my neck an inch away from the screen, making my second Candace Swing Pole Hell's Bells video because the first one got pulled off the internet. I don't want to be doing that. I wasn't doing that for me. I was doing that for little Jimmy who wasn't a stoolie when that first video came out. For that kid who'd never seen the Hell's Bells walk. That's what I was doing it for. I wasn't doing it for me. I I'm hungry as fuck. Somebody who's not hungry doesn't make the same video that already got deleted. Dumb question. How how do you feel about your coworkers and how they've handled the situation? There was an obituary written by Kevin Clancy, I believe. Yeah, it's funny. It's funny. Everybody wants a shot at the king. This has just been one big pat on the ass for me. Like, you know, people just waiting for a little slip up and then they come from all corners of the internet. The day they stop doing that's the day I have problems. Music. Can we use the Boston mug next time? How about we sell some shit? Instead of these mock press conferences. <laughs>